Hot up, Sagittarius. Okay, Sag. I can see you're dealing with somebody here who is very regretful about the way that they uh, handled the situation with you or, or did not handle somebody who did not move in a way that you needed this person to move in your life and to show up for you, okay? Now, when we got this card right here, we have the, um, the uh, Nine of uh, Wands and the uh, the sun card here. This person is very regretful because you was the daggone sun, uh, Sag, okay? You were very beautiful, fine, elegant, graceful, okay? With this person. You gave them a lot of happiness. A lot of light, excuse me. A lot of peace, okay? This person wants to finish what they started with you. They they feel that they put in enough work and enough time and enough sexual uh, energy because I feel that you're separated from this person. Uh, the Seven of Wands is also somebody who is very um, wounded because you are separated. They are wishing on a star or they're praying to the universe, praying to their deities, praying to the gods that they worship or their ancestors. That they can get their wish with you. That they can finish what they started with you. But it's like, uh, I feel that, uh, Sag, that you just went ahead and left this person alone. Now, who are we dealing with? We have the Barberry Zodiac Oracle cards. You could be dealing with an Aquarius. Okay? Aquarius. Somebody who was supposed to be showing you love, but didn't show you the type of love that you deserve. You could be dealing with a fire sign. Another Sagittarius, Leo, Aries, okay? Somebody who's very passionate, Nine of Wands, very passionate in their sexual energy and their sexual communication with you, but didn't show up like you needed them to. Sagittarius, you could also be dealing with a Cancer, okay? Somebody who held back their love and went in their shell and didn't show you what you needed to be shown. This is a double confirmation of a Sagittarius, planet Jupiter, okay? This person may have been another Sagittarius, maybe Sag on Sag relationship. And one of the Sag was the star and the sun while the other person was in some type of devil energy. You're dealing with somebody who has devil energy. Now let's go ahead and get you the uh, Tarot of Sexual Magic. Get you three shuffles, Sag. This is your Twin Flame reading for the month of... April 2021. Uh, this for your sun, moon, rising, Venus, Lilith, signs, love. And I, my darling, am the cosmic divine tarot. And I want to talk about this crone right here being regretful. What exactly happened here or did not happen here, y'all? Okay. We got the, uh, the knave of pentacles. This person looked like there's somebody who was, uh, has some type of um, drug addiction, okay? They could have been addicted to you. They could have been addicted to your body, Sagittarius. Now, I, I gave Aquarius this same type of reading with somebody who was addicted to them. So you may be dealing with an aqua, all right? Now, Sagittarius, yeah, let's get some more. Okay, this person's been waiting, waiting while they've been in uh uh. Because they've been alone as the old crone here, the devil. They, they're alone right here in their devil negative energy, drinking and doing all types of drugs, okay? This person has been waiting to meet up with you and showing you the type of love and affection that you deserve. Like sitting at the table and putting their legs and rubbing their feet up against your leg and all in between your legs, Sag. You know, maybe they want to share a drink with you, okay? Now we got... uh. We got two cards here. We have the uh, two of swords as well as the justice here. Yeah, you're doing a two of swords with this person. Looks like you're leaving this person alone, but they think they can come back towards you with some type of gifts and whatnot, but you're not with that, Sag, okay? Here is the justice here. You felt you didn't have any just offer with this person. You felt this person was not somebody who was giving you your just deserves here. You know what I'm saying? You felt like, you know, you just... Should have been given more by this person. This person should have been doing more for you. To arrive for you. To show up for you. But let's go ahead into this nine of wands here. This person being all um, upset because of temperance. You are not just the star, baby. You are the temperance. You are this person's peace of mind. Their serenity. Okay. Got two, three more cards here. Okay. 
But you look like told look like you and told this person go ahead and kiss your ass, Sage. Or this person is dreaming about it, but wanting to finish, wanting you to take off this daggone dress that you're wearing and be booty butt naked in front of them, okay? So that they can be all up in the booty. You know, they like your booty. They like it very much, baby. Okay? Like it very much. Now, here we got the uh, Ace of Daggone Swords. This person wants to come into your life, dominate you with the wand, with the sword here. Very strong seduction. Tie you up to the bed. Like, do a daggone misery move. Your behind belongs to me. Here is the daggone judgment. That is their judgment. Okay? They're their judgment they may want to have a child with you or this may be somebody who you already have a child with or maybe somebody who you wanted to have a child with in the past and this person wants to come in and uh dominate that ass as their ass now let's go ahead and get into that star tell sagittarius more about this star right here sagittarius being this beautiful energy star magic you were magic. They are hoping to get their magic back. They are hoping with the magician here to utilize everything that they have to come back into your life. They want to use this sword, this wand, to passionately and strongly seduce you. They want to give you this chalice right here to pour the, the love and affection on you. They want to give you that pentacle to give you the affection and the effort and the time that you deserve and eat all the food off of your body. Lay your naked body on the couch and just devour everything off of you. Lick it off of your breast, your butt, your kitty, your wand, your feet. Okay, yes, yeah, seven of pentacles, seven of uh, chalices here. Okay, this person wants to do all types of things with you. Light the candle, share the wine, put, got the little purse right here. Okay, with the pentacle, they're trying to buy you off, Sag. This person is going to come into your life trying to buy you off, Sag. Trying to go ahead and be a magician and, uh, you know, put some type of work on you. Could be that too. Now let's go ahead and get into the love oracle cards here, baby. Okay. Golden mirror. Are you dealing with a self-absorbed narcissist? The relationship is one-sided love bombing. This person coming back into your life love bombing you. Kissing all over your booty. Kissing all over your mouth. Taking your clothes off and everything, okay? That's what this person wants to do. They want to have your breast out. They want to have your tongue down their throat. But, uh, Sag, you're going to have to feel great first and feel the feeling of having a partner healthy relationship. Raise your vibration and you will attract this type of person, not a narcissist, baby. You got ascending here, okay? You're transcending obstacles and preparing for a new phase, a new union, baby. Because these patterns that you've been attracting people uh, and dating, how you've been dating these people who do not have what it is that you need, you're about to change that, baby. You are aware of that as you are ascending and realizing your light you are a divine being having a human experience. You know you have to be healed to attract heal. Let's go ahead and get you a dark mirror. The person who you were dealing with, you felt they had an artificial heart. You felt that they were not real with you, which made you cry, which made you feel bad because they were giving you bits and pieces. They were not giving you their whole self. This made you hurt. This made you feel in pain. This made you feel rejected, Sag. But it's like, you know, right now, you're ascending. You gave this person your ass to kiss, and this person intends on kissing your ass, okay? You are this person's happiness. They feel wounded now that you're gone, that their temperance is gone, wishing upon a star ancestor, the, the universe, being very regretful about the relationship coming to its end. They're trying to get you back, baby. And they're trying to utilize all types of different options to get you back, okay? That's what the seven of... um. That's what the seven of uh, chalices is saying here, okay? Utilizing all types of different options. Now, baby, I don't know if these things are going to work with you because you've been waiting for this person to show you and to show up in your life how they need to show up in your life. But, Sag, uh, like I said, I don't know if it's going to work. It might, baby. It might work. This person may just go ahead and bring their A game to get you back because they want to finish what they started with you and they are wounded at the fact that y'all are no longer together or that you're walking away. 
If you haven't walked away entirely, you are walking away. Like I said, baby. Okay? Yeah, their judgment is to come on back. And after you gave them your ass to kiss, they intend on kissing, licking, sucking, rubbing, squeezing, smacking all over that ass. Okay? Said Jack. Now, my darling, this has been your reading. If it resonated with you, then hit that like share and subscribe to my channel hit the bell notifier to know when i will be uploading new messages for you Sag. and if this is not your message then don't you worry about that i'm just gonna go ahead and get you next time Sag. okay <laughs> Sag. if you want to donate to my channel the link to my cash app and my paypal is in the description box below and i certainly will appreciate your donations i certainly need them okay now, uh, until next time, baby, peace, love, and light, Sajjing. Hot up, love.